I'm here in Coventry Market Centre Circle, where a newly unveiled photography exhibition showcasing legendary rap group Wu-Tang Clan on their God of Rap Tour is up and running. The exhibition is the first of many for Coventry's newly set up community gallery space. I spoke to Simon Peter Green, the ex-tour and production manager for Wu-Tang Clan, on his exhibition. So the exhibition is about a tour that happened in the spring called The Gods of Rap, which featured Wu-Tang Clan Headline, um, Public Enemy, De La Soul and DJ Premier. Um, I used to be the tour manager for Wu-Tang Clan and I, in a lot of ways I'm still a member of the family. So I went to see the first show in Wembley and Divine, the manager, who used, has been, been my boss, so they signed, why don't you come on the tour? So I did. It's, it's recognised um, in the industry that Wu-Tang Clan are quite difficult to manage on the road, to say the least. Now, I don't find that. Um, they are real professionals um, and easy to work with, in my view. They got their ways, but hey, um, who hasn't? So, yeah, once I worked for Wu-Tang Clan, my phone started to go more regularly for other artists because the feeling was, you know, if you can work with Wu-Tang Clan, you can do anything. But I hadn't planned to do this exhibition. It just came out of circumstances, um, which is great. But now what you see is an amazing gallery space. So I am the first artist to exhibit in this space. It's been such a privilege, but I won't be the last. Um, the market management are intending to ask local artists or whatever to come through every two or three weeks. I also spoke to Coventry Market Manager Brian Sexton on his decision to showcase the exhibition and his plans for the future of the new gallery space. I mean, we want to create something that uh, anybody can come and use. So it doesn't have to be a photographic exhibition, it can be writing, it can be uh, three-dimensional things, it can just be anything really that engages with the community um, and this is quite a diverse community in here um, and it's an exciting place to, to, to be in, it's an unpredictable, um, vibrant space so you know, people are open that people will just come in and just make use of the space for whatever they want to do because we're looking, for, we're looking to exhibit stuff that you wouldn't normally find within a market so I'm not really keen on, on putting in somebody who can crochet you know, doll's dresses, this is about things that challenge the community and also challenge the artists in, in putting things that are, that are in a different environment, in an environment where you wouldn't expect to see things. Mm. We've got a, uh, an exhibition of, um, a, of a London artist um, that we own quite a bit of their work for, so we'll be announcing that shortly, that will go up. Uh, and then we've had quite a few inquiries from people uh, from this exhibition, so we'll start to book those in. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm quite you know, happy that we're going to have it at full for at least the next few months anyway. The Wu-Tang Clan exhibition will be ending in just a few days. However, many think this is just the start for Coventry's new gallery space. Jamie Garwood, iGov News.